McVeigh said Thursday that he obviously can't explain the detailed meaning behind the audibles, though the Rams' opponents would be grateful if he did. But he did share some insight. A lot of those words are from the players, from the coaching staff. There's a lot of people that are involved that I think you try to have fun with some of those code words and the communication, McVeigh said, via Turf Show Times. I think Jared's done an excellent job with that, and some of them mean something. Some of them don't. Guys have fun with it. How can you not have fun with audibles invoking the names of Barack Obama and Ric Flair? Using unusual audibles like this makes it easier for players to remember them. College football does this with memes and damages on play cards on the sidelines. And plenty of teams have had fun with it at the pro level this year. We've heard a booty, booty, booty call from Josh McCown, and the Steelers used a dilly-dilly audible on Thursday night football against the Titans. Dak Prescott even called a Shanahan audible in Week 1 against the Giants. It was a run play, and of course, 